Sonachu, Issue 1, Hand-Drawn Premiere Issue. Go, Sonachu. Go out and zap to the extreme, orders Chris. I will. Thank you, Father. Episode 1, Sonachu's Origin. Our story begins in an open field, five miles from the city of Station Square, which is under siege by the perfect chaos monster. While Sonic the Hedgehog ponders over the destruction, a wild boy Pikachu takes notice of the far-off destruction. I am Christian Weston Chandler, Sonichu's creator and author of this comic. This is his story, and nothing less. Pika? The Pikachu glances at the action behind him. Meanwhile, we witness Sonic engage in battle against the perfect chaos monster, who is a blue, dinosaur-like creature. As Sonic continues his battle, he summons crystals to aid him. The wild Pikachu continues to run towards the perfect chaos monster. The Pikachu eventually collides with Sonic. Ouch, they both exclaim. Meanwhile, 15 miles away, we see a girl Raichu inquisitively staring at the battle in the distance. A rainbow emerges from where Sonic and Pikachu collided, and this rainbow continues to jettison up towards the sky, eventually striking the girl Raichu. The Raichu transforms into a pink, Sonic-like creature. At the cottage, a girl says, Raichu, I saw them. <gasps> Who are you? Where's my Pokemon? Kel, says the newly formed pink creature. I am your Pokemon. I was hit by a rainbow, and now I have transformed. Oh my, exclaimed the trainer. You're as beautiful as a rose. As a rose? Says the Pokemon. I need a new name, since I'm a new Pokemon. So, you may call me Rosachu. We return to the scene of the battle. However, instead of Sonic and Pikachu engaging the perfect chaos monster, we are greeted with what appears to be a yellow version of Sonic. Ah, uh, this creature says as he regains consciousness. What? <clears throat> I've changed. Huh? He says, witnessing the perfect chaos monster re-emerging. The battle is on? I've got to help. Time to zap. He rapidly runs towards the monster and culminates this charge with a thunder attack. The creature lets out a terrible roar. Uh, almost got him. After a few more aerial maneuvers, Sonichu defeats the perfect chaos monster. Sonic, 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 yay, chants the crowd. Later, we find this newly formed hybrid creature contemplating that day's battle near a beach illuminated only by the sunset. Wow, what a battle. Not only that, but I've received super speed, a new body, and above all else, I am able to talk like a human. Wow. And, apparently, I look like that hedgehog I've helped earlier. From the cheers, I guess his name was Sonic. Sonic the Hedgehog. Sonic had just about the same abilities as I do now, and I guess I am now a hedgehog now too. I am a new Pokemon. I am no longer a Pikachu, so with inspiration, I am now... Sonichu. Christian reemerges with a narrator's note. And from then on, Sonichu went on to make new friends as well as enemies. And he will use his abilities to stop evil and to save the world. Stay tuned for more zapping adventures of Sonichu. As the creator of Sonichu and his world, I feel that I should take you on a trip to learn more. Besides, I promised my other hedgehogs as well. So let's tour my section of the cartoon world. The comic title is Sonichu. By that we man the saga of the electric hedgehog Pokemon. Location. It is set in and around the city of Quickville. A vibrant community with good people and average among of cool places to chill at. I am the mayor. Characters. This is Sonichu, the electric hedgehog Pokemon. 
and main character. Age, 16 years. Hobbies, running, surfing, chilling, mostly outdoor activities. Other facts, he enjoys the scenery around him. His favorite colors are yellow and blue, and he enjoys popular music. And he loves Rosichu. Rosichu is a spunky and very beautiful girl electric hedgehog Pokemon. Age 15, hobbies, frolicking through the fields, shopping at Quickville Mall, and cooking. Her original trainer is the caring girl, Kel. Rosie is Rosichu's nickname, and she likes to pick flowers. Her favorite flower is the Zap Bud. She always keep her heart saved for her Sonichu. Kel is Rosichu's caring Pokemon trainer, and Nate Cirque is the son of Team Rocket boss Giovanni. Nate Cirque is a red-haired boy with goggles, a green jacket, and black track pants. Black Sonichu, aka Blachu. He's Sonichu's evil twin. He was created in Giovanni's lab from Sonichu's DNA with an accidental dose of Cherry Cola. From the rainbow of Chaos Emerald Energy, eggs were released into various locations around the world. They hatched into five more electric hedgehogs with special characteristics. When all the hedgehog Pokemon are together, they make up the Chaotic Combo. The Chaotic Combo includes Wild Sonichu, a green Sonichu who is grass and electric, Wild was raised in a jungle by a Venusaur, who taught him Razor Leaf, and a Scyther taught him how to access his speed and ninja skills. Bubbles Rosichu, a blue Rosichu who is water electric. Bubbles was raised by a mother Swamper, who taught her to create tidal waves. Bubbles has a happy, positive personality, and she just loves to have fun. Angelica Rosichu, a white Rosichu who is flying electric. Angelica was raised in a church by nuns. Angelica is a believer, so she prays every night and day. She is usually at peace, especially while flying sky high. Magichan Sonichu, a purple Sonichu who is psychic electric. Magichan raised himself in the mountains as he meditated and perfected his telekinetic powers. He tends to keep to himself a lot. Punchy Sonichu, a red Sonichu who is fighting electric. Punchy grew up in a dojo where he perfected his punches. He is also full of random Axis humor. He lost his tail in a brutal fight. Flame the Sunbird is the protector of the Master Sunstone on the mysterious Rainbow Island. Of mysterious origins, three more electric hedgehog Pokemon will rock Quickville. Christian Sonichu, who is blue, Sarhama Rosichu, who is yellow, and Wes Lee Sonichu, who is orange. And then a couple of two-bit villains. I wouldn't even give two cents for them. Mary Lee Walsh and Jerkops. And lastly, there is me, the intrusive creator in Sonichu's story, Christian Weston Chandler. Basics, 5 feet 10 inches, born on February 24th, 1982. I'm working towards a computer-aided drafting and design degree at Piedmont, Virginia Community College. I am also single, lonely, and I need a girlfriend. To describe myself in real life, I am a very creative person. I enjoy playing video games, Sonic the Hedgehog, Pokemon, Animal Crossing. I also like to build with Lego pieces and I enjoy most kinds of music. I am also fascinated with the Transformers. I also play the Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh! trading card games. 